This is Joanne Tan, 10 Plus Brand. Today, in part two of four, I'm focusing on what business leaders should do now to develop AI tools to get a head start. In part one, I provided a step-by-step -step checklist for helping organizational leaders with AI-related decision-making. In summary, leadership needs to do all three things listed below to prepare themselves for the AI wave now. First, develop content for feeding your generative AI tools. Second, develop leaders and people, including A, upscaling, reskilling, retooling, B, employees going upwards and CEOs going downwards, and C, the future of work and customer experience. Third, develop what AI cannot do and develop experience design to train AI to serve humanity. This part two focuses on how to develop content or data that feeds generative AI. The quality of AI tools is determined by underlying data content. AI is entirely dependent on the content we humans feed it. Your AI tools are as good or bad as the underlying data. One of the ironclad rules for AI is garbage in, garbage out, as I described in an article I wrote in January 2023, shortly after ChatGPT was launched. If AI is fed with disinformation, misinformation, bias, AI will magnify, amplify, and multiply disinformation, misinformation, bias. As stated in a recent article published on The Economist magazine, in an interview with Henry, with Henry Kissinger on May 13th, 2023, quote, Kissinger acknowledges that even experts in AI do not know what its powers will be. But Mr. Kissinger believes that AI will become a key factor in security within five years. He compares its disruptive potential to the invention of printing, which spread ideas that played a part in causing the devastating wars of the 16th and 17th centuries. Kissinger said, quote, there are no limitations. Every adversary is 100% vulnerable. We live in a world of unprecedented destructiveness." Unquote. To train generative AI to be a constructive power for your brand as well as for all other AI usages, the content you feed your AI tools must be well-written, responsible, and connecting positively with your target audience. It must at minimum do your target audience good and do no evil to any others. Your AI content needs to put your brand in a strategic position, elevated above the crowd. To that end, your brand messages and brand voice must be original and unique. For that purpose, you cannot rely solely on ChatGPT's mediocre, rudimentary, and outdated, about two years behind, content. As of today, December 15, 2023. ChatGPT's ubiquitous reach makes it easy for the mass to regurgitate the very rudimentary ChatGPT content, available to everyone and distinguishes no one. Consequently, no brand is standing out upon its unique value propositions. As of now, generative AI is not there yet with high quality content in compliance with privacy, security, and intellectual property requirements. This actually gives a company the needed time now to hone your company's unique brand voice and messaging, ready to be amplified and multiplied when AI matures. Why content is the make or break factor for AI? Let me use a website as an analogy. A website or an AI tool is just a container, a shell. It is the content and the structure thereof inside a website or AI that impresses, intrigues, and connects with prospective buyers. How the content is structured, how the stories are told about the products or services, what the next steps are to a purchase, who are the sellers, how they solve buyers' needs, wants, and pain points. It's the content that makes a website tick. It's the content that makes an AI tool tick. 
A good AI tool, just like a good website, plays a positive role in customer journey by making it easier for customers to find what they want or solve their pain points with clear messaging, easy navigation, customer-centric experience design, and emotional delight. After years of creating branded websites that tick for our clients and seeing too many below-par, underperforming websites, the unchangeable truth is content and experience design are the make or break factors for a website and for an AI tool. Who creates your unique brand voice? How? Not ChatGPT, GPT-4, or Dell e not any form of generative AI. You create your own unique brand voice, brand persona, brand messages, be it a company brand or personal brand. After your own brand voice, brand persona, and brand messages are carefully strategized, well-researched, uniquely honed, correctly worded, and inputted to a machine learning database of your generative AI, you have laid a solid foundation for generative AI to amplify your brand. How to create great content for AI? The short answer is there is no magic bullet, no shortcut, no overnight success. Content is a snapshot of a growing company's unique value propositions which evolve over time. Great content and customer experience design are the results of ceaselessly searching for better ways of serving customers. Customer-centric companies are always on the lookout for customer friction points designing, redesigning, inventing, and reinventing systems, processes, and technology. At the same time, their workforce must be constantly uplifted, upskilled, and reskilled. Content creation is an intentional progression that involves regularly strategizing and realigning with the company's vision, mission, goals. Content creation is an intentional progression that involves regularly strategizing and realigning with the company's vision, mission, goals. Content creation is also a multifaceted process of seeking authentic emotional connection with customers, all of which AI cannot do since AI cannot strategize, does not have EQ, and cannot develop vision and adjust to changing goals. Feeding your AI tools with organic and healthy food is not once and done. It is a perpetual dance between your customers' improved experience, satisfaction, changing expectations, and your constantly upgraded products and services through human workforce and your generative AI. What content should not be fed to AI? Private, personal, proprietary data and harmful, defamatory, untrue information should not be fed to generative AI. I'm not getting into this can of worms. Who decides what is truth and what is harmful information? Next, as part three or four, I will discuss develop leaders and people for the age of AI. About myself, Joanne Tan, I am an executive brand coach, brand strategist, content creator, leading 10 Plus Brand Inc., a multiple award-winning brand building, brand marketing, global digital marketing agency. Please feel free to contact us for any content and branding advice by visiting 10plusbrand.com. Thank you.